coming up in next. Oh. oh. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel, Marshall with Marshall Law uh, Morphs, and Leo with Leo M Law Morphs. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Alright guys, so we got another clutch to cut here. This, If you know me at all, you know this is kind of like a very special clutch or a big clutch for me, I guess. Uh, this was my Super Lace Mail to Citrus Pastel Calico, so we're looking to get some Lace, Citrus Pastel, uh, Calico stuff. Um, you know I'm big into the lace gene and I want to further it so here at Martial Law Morphs so without further ado let's get into this I'm pretty excited about this guys I think that goes without saying but do, 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 do. and this time I won't mess with my lovely assistant Leah and I'll actually open these eggs towards her so ooh. so we got a pastel lace of course we know with the super lace being in the mix we know that everything in this clutch is going to be at the very least lace so it looks like ooh, god those are so nice looking at the very least we're going to have lace in every single one of these which I'm super happy about it. <laughs> takes the guesswork out of that. It takes the guesswork out of it for sure. It looks like we got ourselves a lace here. Maybe even, pa oh, pastel lace. Again, so two pastel lace. Sweet. Those are so clean looking, mm -hmm. right? I like it, I like it. Um, now this one here is just my opinion on this guys but when you're working with the lace I think those lines of pastel like the citrus and the lemon are probably going to be your best bet to make a nice clean bright pastel so ooh, that one I do believe is going to be our lace pastel calico we'll have to it's got a little bit of a oh yeah most definitely Sweet. See how much lighter it is than. Mm -hmm. It was one one of the reasons for this pairing is, you know, there wasn't a whole lot of pictures out there on the lace calico, so it's something I really wanted to see. What the influence between lace and calico is going to be like, and I think looking to be pretty nice now maybe in the future add some yellow belly to that I think it's going to be pretty phenomenal pastel pastel lace sweet the other thing about this this kind of curiosity of mine is this is this female's second pairing um, in her, her her second clutch I should say, say in that first clutch she only threw <laughs> one calico so so far we're right on track with that and coming up in next oh lace pastel calico yep. for sure oh, she's one up this year see <laughs> she's one up <laughs> that's right next year we'll have three <laughs> Nice, it's just, a, just a calico, just calico lace, just to see the difference without the pastel. And again, looks to be a, ooh, I think we might have the three gener in this one as well. So that one's a possible calico. Lace pastel, possible calico. Lace pastel, calico for sure. The color. Is I think this is calico. 
Yeah, because the color is very similar to these two right mm -hmm. here. The color on the sides is very, that pink, and that's what's gonna, mm -hmm. gonna come up from the calico, you know, straight and out of the egg. And there's so much little pattern. Yeah, so we might have three, three geners. Oops, sorry. Two, two geners. That is super cool. Woohoo! Let's see. So it's looking off initially, you know, and this these always change when you're dealing with looking into an egg. It's looking like initially late three lace pastels and three lace pastel calicos. <laughs> super sweet. Oh, look at that belly pattern. Good shot of the belly there. Do, 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 do. Oh, I suppose I should get my hand up. That is so cool. All right, guys. So there we have it. Uh, second lace clutch of the year. We do have a third one uh, coming up. Uh, hopefully soon, as far as pulling it, we should have that super lace to the Blackhead Phantom. We should be pulling that anytime now. Uh, so as always, guys, like, comment, share, subscribe, ding that notification bell, and we'll see you real soon.